Hello and welcome to another Purveyor of Light Photoshop Quick Tip. Uh, as we all know by now, uh, Adobe has finally put Generative Fill uh, right into the final uh, Photoshop product. So it's now no longer a beta feature. And uh, that's great and wonderful. But sometimes we come into an odd situation of censorship from Adobe. Uh, for what reasons I do not understand or know, but they say it goes against their gui guidelines. So here I have a photo, and I'm just gonna select the crop tool, and I'm gonna select generative expand, okay, from the, the list here. And then I'm going to uh, just take my crop tool, and I am going to just expand it down a little bit, okay? All right? So, then we'll do that. And then I'm here on the generative fill box. I'm just going to hit generate. And it's going to go ahead and do some calculations. And um, depending on how things, here we go. It says, I've generated image or removed. Please review the guidelines. And with no other really great explanation other than that, and it resets things. Um, it puzzles me, but I'm sure there's a reason for it. But there is a workaround, and luckily, uh, Pixel Perfect Nimish uh, uh, was very grateful and helpful in solving this problem, and the workaround to get it to generate questionable photos uh, is so easy so let me show you so again we're gonna hit the crop tool and I'm going to do the exact same thing expand the picture I'm gonna be on generative expand and this time in the generative box I'm gonna put a period put a period and now hit generate and now Photoshop will go ahead and bypass the censorship and generate the image. And there we go. A beautiful job. Okay, and then I have three images to choose from from there. Okay, so there you go. It's a quick and easy one, but it sure does come in handy because sometimes I do this to pictures and I have no idea why they think it needs to be censored. Uh, and this is a photo right here, a prime example why why would it need to be censored? All right, so that's the workaround, guys. Put a period in the prompt and then hit generate, and that'll bypass that censorship uh, error. All right, till next week, you guys take care.